All right, I'm gonna work on the back part of the buffalo today a little bit. I'm not gonna do much because um, we're not gonna be here that long. And I'm gonna start packing up and heading back to the house. Um, and I'll continue that this week. So let's get started. Time to play with some clay. I gotta change the light position so I can see the detail of the body a little bit better. For some reason I gotta ridge right here and I gotta take it down a little bit <coughs> for the uh, type of patina that I want to put on this bronze or the bronze of this uh, piece um, I've got to have the uh, skin of the buffalo a little smoother A lot of smoothing will be done with a lighter fluid and a Brillo when I get home. I can't do that here, it'd be too smelly. running into is like the old clay right here you can see the color difference and the new clay that old clay is really hard what I might have to do is get my hair blower from my bathroom and uh, hit the uh, clay with some hot air and that'll soften up a lot of this stuff
how's it going today? It's going. <laughs> right on. Slow but sure. Not quite the 4th of July. Thank God. <laughs> yeah. I'm ready for everybody to go home. <laughs> uh. The only reason I'm down here is because my wife drug me down here. And I needed to go to True Value and get some poison. And she wanted to go look at Plain Jane. So yeah. I couldn't stand it in the car any longer. And I saw you in here. Playing with clay. Playing with clay. Well, there's some great things to look at in here if you're in the business of looking up. up. But um, a lot of things that not everybody needs. There's three wild nights. Well, I don't know what I'd do with anything that big. Well, there's some pocket knives back here. I'd probably get myself in trouble. Maybe. Well, you could chop down a tree. Right? But you better have a permit, permit to do that. Yeah, that reminds me, I gotta go get some firewood one of these days. As soon as they cool it down and the horse flies go away. Yeah, that's a deterrent to those horse flies. Yeah, the, the pier fly dropped yesterday at Troutville. Be careful, Lee. Where are you? Afternoon. How are you? Good. Oh, wow. Cool. That's so cool. I liked the way you took a double take. Yeah. Ooh, what's he doing? Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, wow. That is cool. Very cool. And how long have you been working on that? Uh, off and on, five years. So you don't like something, you cut it back off and re... Well, I just lose my inspiration. Got to come back to it later. And I've got something else i got to do. And these are all things I've been doing since. Actually, all those I've done since I started working on this one. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I saw the real sign, but so you're not keeping the store down here or anything? Uh, no, we're just uh, selling off some merchandise. Yeah. He's probably going to keep trying to sell his stuff that he's got left over from the when he got is, the building. Yeah. Oh, here you go. Uh, that's going to be it for today and uh, till next week sometime I'm not sure what day I'll be back uh, on line with my videos uh, I've got to pack everything up from here all my clays I've got on the table and on display and uh, then I've got to get them arranged in my studio and at some point I got to move a lot of molds from the storage here and take them to my storage uh, up north. So I'm going to be playing it by ear. I hope you guys have a great rest of the weekend, and I'll see you next week or the week after. Good night. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.